I've been talking a little positively recently. I, I need to stop. Let's just go. This is going to be my worst review right now. I will just say it right now. This is going to be the film out of all the 10 that I talk about today that I just hate. I hate this movie. I hate this movie starring Jack Harlow, a guy that cannot act. I, I don't know what Hollywood was thinking when they're like, we'll cast him in the role that Woody Harrelson made famous. The, the downgrade of going from Woody Harrelson to Jack Harlow is shocking. Harlow's not a good rapper, and he's a really exceptionally bad actor. This film also stars Sinclair Walls, who I wouldn't necessarily call a great actor, just he looks so much better when compared to Jack Harlow. This is uh, directed by Comatic, who directed a film earlier this year called House Party, which I found to be eh, but not terrible. Uh, this movie that I'm about to talk about makes House Party look like uh, Casablanca. This movie is called White Men Can't Jump. Yes, the remake to the Wesley Snipes Woody Harrelson movie from the 90s. Here's the description of the movie. If you've seen White Man Can't Jump, you, you'll know the plot of this movie. But seemingly opposite street hoopers, Jeremy, an injury-prone former star, and Kamal, a has-been prodigy, team up to take one final shot at living out their dreams. Let's, let me just say right now, I have no actual relationship to the movie White Men Can't Jump, except that I like Woody Harrelson and like Wesley Snipes. I've never seen the movie. So me going into this, this is not going to be a review of, oh my God, how could they bastardize this 90s classic beloved film that I have a powerful relationship with that I love so dearly. How could they even think about remaking this? That is not the case of this review. The reason this movie sucks is because this movie sucks because Jack Harlow cannot act to save his life. This is the worst performance that I think I've seen on the big screen in quite a while. I just don't know what he what they're thinking. He has no charisma. Zero. Absolutely none. In fact, he has so little charisma that he actually takes away the charisma of other actors in this scene who look like they have better charisma than him, but standing next to him, he is like a vacuum for charisma. He sucks it all up, and he keeps it for himself, and yet he can't let it out. I just don't understand what Jack Harlow is doing in this movie. Woody Harrelson is charisma king, and Jack Harlow should never be in the same sentence as Woody Harrelson, except for this one sentence, which is Jack Harlow sucks. And he sucks in comparison to Woody Harrelson. He is not funny. And this film asks him to be funny. He, this film asks him to be funny in a really like big way. And every turn, every time he gets up to play, he misses, he swings and it is a giant thud. He took a literal crap on screen. And it's so bad i just don't understand anything about what he's even trying to accomplish in this it literally looks like harlow and the actor uh which was uh walls it, i i think walls actually hates harlow because there's zero chemistry between these two i just just watching this i'm like oh my god who greenlit this idea and who saw these two actors together sorry who saw this actor and this whatever the hell he is together and thought this was a good idea. The story is cliche. I, every joke is predictable. There is no fun. There's no laughs. It's every joke that is in this movie is the most broad, most easy joke you can think of. There's no creativity here. This is bad. I've done talking about this film, but for Jack Harlow, you get something really special, probably like your last album sales and the reviews for your last album. I'm giving you a zero. This is God awful. I hated watching this film. You know, the only thing that I liked about this film is I like the sport of basketball and I like the NBA. And after watching this movie, I like the NBA and basketball just a little bit less. I now found myself, I'm like, you know, maybe I should turn my life to hockey because Jack Harlow, if you like this sport, if you like the NBA, then I feel embarrassed to like the NBA as well. My God, never ever act again for the love of God, for the love of God. I just, just work on your rap career, which isn't good, but maybe you'll get another Lil Nas X feature 
and you'll have like five good lines in that. And that will be your legacy. Prove me wrong, but you're not a good actor. Uh, zero out of five stars for white men can't jump. <laughs>